Satan is uh, the representation of evil in the dichotomy between good and evil. Uh, the greatest definition we get of Satan and his place in the cosmology is in the book of Job, where uh, Satan uh, presents himself before God along with the sons of God, who many people will say those are the angels, the Malachim, the, the messengers of God. And it seems that Satan in this sense is a, is a tempter. He's the one that causes death. He's the one that causes chaos um, and all of these different things. He is the one, according to Christian doctrine, he's the one that tempts you to do any of the evils that, uh, that we consider uh, men and women to do. Uh, so talk to us a little bit about who Satan or the devil is. In, in modern day Christianity is just what you said. He's the antagonist to God. He is the, the one that is going to do everything to keep you off track, to do everything contrary to you fulfilling your purpose. But but I, I like to say this though, brothers. I, I think when we look at the devil, Satan, what you just described, my brother, is when you do it from a, uh, a literal translation. See, that's where we have our problems. You know, they're, they're, Jesus said, I speak to these people in parables. You know, the disciples are asking him, you know, why are you always talking to these people in parables? Those that have an ear, let them hear. But for you, I talk about and give you the key, the, the keys to the, 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 the mystery to the kingdom of heaven. Now, when you, there's a such thing between exoteric and esoteric. The esoteric, hey man, Satan, devil, G Jesus, Eshu, they all look the same. Mm. But if we're going to do it from a literal exoteric perspective, yeah, then Satan is the great enemy. Satan is the one that fell from heaven because he was at war with God. He was that one that is fighting everything. And if we look at uh, European Western thought, you have to have an antagonist. Right. Mm -hmm. You know, you, you have to have somebody that is fighting. Now, we know in most African traditional uh, spiritual systems, there is no devil. But for this conversation and this court case, uh, <laughs> I think I'm going to agree with you, brothers. On an esoteric level, the devil and S.U. is the same individual. 